Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, YC Rhino here, and it's time for the season finale reaction of RuPaul's Drag Race UK. We're down to our last three queens, and I've got to say, I think these, these are the right three queens. I think they were probably the most consistent the whole season. Um, we've got Davina DeCampo, Bag of Chips, and the Vivian. Um, I think my favorite, if I had to pick one, is probably Davina. I don't know, she has somewhat of an underdog spirit that I like, so I, I do hope that she wins. Um, last week, Cheryl Hole went home, which I think we kind of saw that coming for a while now. Uh, they had the family makeover challenge, and gosh, like the more I thought about it, Bag of Chips was so harsh on her mom. I mean, I, I understand that, you know, sometimes families you know, there's a dynamic in family and maybe outsiders don't understand it, but it just kind of bothered me that she kind of blamed her mom being shy on her not performing well in that challenge. So hopefully, you know, she will perform so well in this last season finale that I'll forget that. But, but it's going to be hard for me to forget that. I think now every time I think of her, I think about that. And, and I don't know, it's just, it was kind of off-putting. All right, let's go ahead and get started. Hope you enjoy my reaction. Oh, Cheryl, I'm gonna miss you, girl, you crazy dumb bitch. <laughs> bye bye, my lover. Love you, baby. Oh. God, she uses very cheap lipstick, though. Oh. <laughs> I have got on with every girl. I couldn't give those girls a real mirror. I love them all. How is it lip sync? And has this got you out of your little rush? Oh my God, I know it. Like, when you lip sync as well, it's not nice, is it? Yeah. But to win a lip sync <laughs> is amazing. Damien is like, I would know. <laughs> That's what she just said. Sorry about it. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. You are, yeah, you've, you have never lip synced, have no. you? No. No. No, I've never been in bottom two. I want to win what? against the best. And I want people to go, you won, because actually you were better. Right, exactly. That's exactly why so, she should win. I mean, all these challenges to go home without a crown, you can piss right off. <laughs> She's like, fuck you, fuck you, and fuck you. All right. May the best queen win. For your final maxi challenge, you'll be serving us an all singing, all dancing performance of my classic song, Rocket to the Moon. Bollocks. We're going to be singing, dancing, everything up, up in the last girl group challenge, really. Yeah. <laughs> like, shit, all the shit, shit I didn't do good at. Oh, well, do you know when we did the frock destroyer? She got another one. I did not notice that Davina always has a red wig. She's got another red wig. I didn't notice that before. I don't know how I didn't notice that. It's pretty much the same as the girl group challenge, and I ended up in the bottom. It was the performance that let me down. Hopefully, I've got faith in my lyrics. I've just got to smash that performance. Yeah, don't. I've been doing drugs. Don't freeze up again. I've probably spoke to my mum like seven times in like 10 years. Wow. I'm not saying she's like a bad mum or anything, because she's not, but I was like brought up with my nan. Because mom wasn't around, she was, she was around, but like she had, a, she had like a new partner and my mom's got other children and, cause there was no room as well. Aww. So it, it was like a mutual decision that I live with my nan. Did you feel abandoned? Did you feel forgotten? I'm not playing the victim because I've had the best life ever. My nan spoiled me rotten. Yeah, but you can still- I don't think you admitting that you're hurt. That's not you playing the victim. Yeah. So I think you've built up a really thick skin mm. and a really I've tall. Got very wall. thick skin. Like, Aww. I, I'm used you pushed to that away, and you like to hide behind your character. But the truth is, you know, we've seen inside your heart, and we love it. And Aww. it's something that you need to embrace also. Like you've changed my life forever, and oh, oh my god! Thank you for that. We're gonna say goodbye, but I'm gonna give you a hug. Oh now. my god! I'm... <laughs> oh wow! RuPaul never touches anybody. <laughs> Oh, oh, that makes me feel. <laughs> you are a star. Okay. Rue actually gave me a cuddle. She just grabbed me by the ear. I am never washing my ear. Oh my ear. God! I have never oh, like. <laughs> there have been a lot of sad <laughs> stories <laughs> over the seasons. I've never seen her hug anybody. That was wow. Did you think you could? I apologize to Faith. So it's Viv Vivian is who you're talking about. She's the voice in your head. Because you've said that you were underestimated by the other Absolutely. Girls. 
it became oh wow a sort of weird I didn't fixation. think about it like that because I respect her so much yeah and maybe Vivian is that voice in her head everything I that she thinks about herself that's not good enough she wow seen the do you same think we represented all the British types of drag oh, well amazing absolutely amazing I had a big fear that everyone was going to try and be Americanizing themselves and saying yeah I'm hunting all that <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's hunting. If I'm going out with a bag of chips, Davina DeCampo and the Vivian, in the world debut of Rocket to the Moon. Okay, I'll, straight out the gate, I don't like that wig that bag of chips has on. It makes her look really like scrunched up up here. I don't like that what she's got on. That dress is not flat of her figure. It's too short. It's your time to fly. Oh my god, the beat that looks great. Oh wow, that's very much like what they had Katya doing in Read You Red Wrote You Red Read You Wrote. I can't think of what it is now. Oh my god, she looks fantastic. Good job. All right, come on, the Vivian. I don't like that wig she's got on. She was worried about. I don't like her outfit though. Wow, good job. I think Davina did the best. I like Davina the best. And then, I don't know, I kind of liked that. I liked what uh, Zaga Chips did. Final three Eleganza Extravaganza. First up, Bag of Chips. Oh, why I gotta be Betty White? <laughs> yeah, it does look like Betty White. That was a perfect green, gorgeous gown, sequin to the like... garb. I've got Cheryl. I do like that dress. Curly Marilyn Wigard. Yes, bitch, don't leave anything with Vaga. Yeah, I was gonna say I don't like it, but actually I do like that green dress. It's pretty. Marilyn <laughs> For her. <laughs> Michelle. Up next, Davina DeCampo. Mm. This really is RuPaul's flag race. Very pretty. I like that. I am saving Princess Queen perfection. This Yet another red wig. Deconstructed Union Jack Black. This is Great Britain at its finest. It's pretty. I Up hear next, the mm. Vivian. Oh. oh the Queen. That's pretty. I'm wearing this sparkling diamond dress. My hair's everything. I feel amazing. Mm, she looks beautiful. Sequence shortage of 2019. <laughs> I'm giving you Barbie. Oh, I love Barbie that Barbie that wig. That wig is good. The makeup is perfect. She looks so pretty. I can't live if living is without you. <laughs> she looks great. Yeah, I like that. Oh, <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> oh, the queens are back! Oh my god! That's crazy! Look how good they look! Oh my god, where did these bitches come from? Right! You know why we're here, don't you? Why? Because we're going to decide who's top two. <gasps> no! That is not for real. 
Are you for real? This is not very. Oh my yeah. god! What? The what? Holy. Oh. Are you for real? Oh shit. <laughs> and you should all be so, so proud of yourselves. I'm sure that you are. You're in the top three, but like, in case you're feeling at all shaky, like, you guys nailed it. And we've got loads of sisters now, and we're yeah, going to be friends good. forever and ever and ever. I don't know. <laughs> Is that? So Crystal leaves the group chat. <laughs> Let's talk get ahead of ourselves. I've made some decisions. Okay, here we go. Davina DeCampo, the Vivian. You the top two? Congratulations, you are the top two queens of the season. This is not your time. I just want to say one of them. They are both amazing. Oh my God. That's so weird that it comes down to Davina and the Vivian because I think like, it, oh my God, that's crazy. That's crazy. They really are the best too though. Come on, Davina. Davina DeCampo. Are they going to do a lip sync? The Vivian. This is going to be a battle royale. I hope somebody got a reveal. You got a wig under a wig. You got some rose petals. You got some butterflies. For the crown. Oh, I'm your man. All right. This is weird. They don't usually sing a man song. They've never sang a man song in a lip sync. I think this has got to be a first. Don't fall though. Made my decision. I think it's gonna be I think it's gonna be the Vivian. I think it's gonna be the Vivian. The time has come to crown our queen. Because I'm just I don't know, something she just looks like a queen. The UK's first drag race superstar is the Vivian. Yay! Oh good for you! I'm happy for either one of them. I love them. I like them both. Oh, The Vivian definitely looks more polished than Davina, but yeah. Oh my god! Good job! The Vivian, my queen. Oh. Is there anything you'd like to say? It's been absolutely great. It's been tremendous. Thank you. <laughs> Not with that shit. Now, if you can't love yourself, how in the hell are you going to love somebody else? Can I get an amen up in here? Amen. All right, now let the music play. Oh. Oh, that's so sweet. I love it. There we are. The Vivian is the first queen to win RuPaul's Drag Race UK. I absolutely hope that there are future seasons in the UK because there is a very different drag aesthetic in the UK. Um, and it was kind of funny kind of listening to them talk because I couldn't understand what they were saying half the times. But, oh, that was so good. I would have been equally as happy, I think, with with Davina DeCampo as I was with the Vivian. I, it was it was good. That's so good. I was like, ha! <laughs> I'm so happy. Oh, and unfortunately, I'm watching this probably like six months after everybody else watched it. So I'm sure I look like a, a freak here being all excited about it. So I can't wait. Now that I've been able to watch the finale, I have been doing everything in my power to avoid spoilers on Twitter and on YouTube. Like I have not anything I saw that was even close 
to the UK, uh, RuPaul's Drag Race UK, I've like avoided it. So now I can go online and I can follow um, my favorite queens. Obviously, I will follow Davina and the Vivian and Baga. Um, so, so good. So, so good. Um, let me know what you guys think. Do you think the right queen won? Do you think it was should have been the Vivian or do you think it should have been someone else? Um, and, uh, wow. That was really good. I liked it. Here we go. We're gonna go ahead and wrap this up. This is we're gonna put a bow on on the UK version, and our next uh, set of reaction videos will be for uh, season twelve of U RuPaul's Drag Race, the US edition. So I hope you guys enjoy these reactions, and I hope you continue to comment and you can continue to come to my channel and watch and subscribe and comment and talk to me and let's. Uh, Let's keep this thing going. So thank you so much. I appreciate it. Bye.